Okay, so in this video clip, uh, we'll take you through how to uh, run a C++ uh, project. And we have a complete solution where we have a header file, source file, and main, and we incorporate those into Google Colab. So as always, uh, if you're implementing C++ code in uh, Google Colab, um, you must put in this double percentage write file and then uh, the name of the file uh, and uh, we execute that uh, we now we've pragma once and then we set out uh, the name of the the function which is going to be multiply that gets written and gets passed into the content folder we'll have a look at that in a moment then uh, like with any cpp uh, solution or project uh, we would have a source file and we could have more than one source file here. We just have one. And the basic idea is that we're going to set up a very simple function where we multiply two variables, X and Y. And uh, then we have our main uh, file, main CPP. And we're going to, because we have C out here, we're going to put in uh, IU stream. And then we're including in the header file and then we're using namespace, which I've used before here, just so that um, uh, that uh, we don't have to put in anything in front of the COT, right? So it just becomes COT, uh, the multiply function, and then end. Um, and then, okay, so we've executed that snippet of code. And then to combine all three files together, we use uh, the percentage script a bash a file. Now this looks a little bit different to what I used before when I was estimating a bond with a single C++ um, file, a main file. Um, and um, I'll leave a link to that below, but this is a little bit different. The syntax here is uh, G++ main CPP multiply CPP and then we have standard equal to C++ 11, and then product, right? Now that product, we could substitute any term in there, um, but whatever we put here, right? Whatever we write in here, we must pass. That object we create, we must pass over here. So if we want to output six by six to get 36, I must put in uh, this syntax here. Now, if we change this to uh, five um, and run again and then execute the entire project and then we should get 30. Okay, so uh, combining then our header file, our source file and the main, um, we have a slightly different syntax uh, to what we used uh, when we ran um, a single file before. Maybe I can show that file. Okay, so to take a look at what we had done before, we had set up actually a bond estimation that this is in C++, and I'll leave the link below. And basically when we ran this um, file for just a single uh, script uh, to produce this estimation, um, Again, it was a write file main.cpp. Then if you notice at the end here, we just have g++ main.cpp. And then we don't have an object here. It's just dot a out. So it's slightly different to what I've set up, what we have here, right? And just to be aware of that. Okay, and I'll leave a link to that video clip um, below the video.